your body can only handle so much sin before it catches up to you. And Brother Bryce, as talented as he may be, he's still just a little bit ignorant about how things in life work. And soon he needs to be able to make that commitment to the ministry. But jumping from one thing to another, we have the only member of Noir in the building tonight, the Nightwalker Jordan Kingsley. The Nightwalker Jordan Kingsley. This man used to be an, an, an absolute top tier human being. He used to be one of my favorite human beings on the planet. And then he got involved with Noir. Well, you know, it's just the bad influences, all it takes is you know, hanging out with that one bad apple and the true. whole bunch. Very true. And his opponent. And, 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 and this guy, I don't know if he needs an exorcism or, or what's going on with him, but that is not normal human behavior. He needs he needs some bread. Some bread. He needs some bread, you know? Well, torn up pieces of bread. The Bible says a man shall not live by bread alone. I think he needs more than just bread. Well, he's a duck. Well, he needs an exorcism. But no, See, he, he's animals, a duck. Animals don't have souls. Animals don't go to heaven. He needs to exorcise the animal spirit out of him. Hold on, hold on, hold on. You're telling me that all dogs go to heaven was no, a lie? It was a lie. I don't believe you. You're trying to ruin my childhood. Don't you do that to me, Pastor. Don't you do that to me, Pastor. I want to see some Duck Duck Goose be played here tonight to Jordan Kingsley's head. Red Goose. Well, stupid little Yeezy mask. So you have to wonder for Kingsley here, without Noir, without Aaron Black, without Mr. Wright, without Mr. Bright, without the numbers game, what kind of a chance does he actually stand in this match? I mean, Jordan Kingsley, as, as much as his attitude has changed over the past couple of years, he is one of the best to do it. Absolutely. Well, he clearly one of, like, easily one of the best to do it, but so is Rob Kilgore. So is Rob Kilgore. Rob Kilgore has trained so many people. He has left some of the best names all time in the business. Yes. And it, it, he used to be part of the Ugly Ducklings, but the Ugly Ducklings went their separate ways. They did. They did. No hurt feelings. It's all love, but everyone wanted different things at the same time, and it just didn't work out. And Rob Kiljoy has been carrying them on as the lone duck. Absolutely. When, when they split away from White Mike and Coach Mike, there was Rob Kiljoy who decided to keep the legend of the Ugly Ducklings alive. Yes, he and, did. And I guess he has fully embraced the, the duck spirit at this point. His favorite movie growing up was The Mighty Ducks. Never seen it. Ducks fly together. Yeah, they do. They actually do. Ducks fly together. And, and Jordan Kingsley still has the mask on. I, um, I'm not sure how he's yeah, going to wrestle with that. I mean, it has an eye hole. But I'm, I'm not sure. The crowd, is, it seems like the crowd is beginning to quack. They are. They're trying to get behind the ugly duckling here. Quack! <laughs> it's just a reflex. I can't even help it. When he does it, I do it. Quack! K Kaysley already looks frustrated. He, he, he looks very confused. He, he, he doesn't look like he's ever fought a goose before. Hey. You cannot let Rob Kiljoy get into your head. Rob Kiljoy is one of the most athletic wrestlers that you are going to see. When you talk about work rate and wrestling, you think of Rob Kiljoy. Jordan Kingsley has got to be on this game here if he wants to come out on top of this match. That's very true. And, and in all fairness, both of these competitors are cardio yes. monsters. Yes. They can go and go and go. This is going to be an extremely fast-paced match, as we have seen already in the opening seconds. You see, I, I always wonder about Kingsley, and ever since he joined New R, I know, I know he feels like he has that, that holy trinity within them, but he also has had the protection. He's also had them in his corner. They are not here tonight. Kingsley has to do this on his own. And, and I think this is going to be a good... 
uh, what, what's the word, stepping stone? Yes. The uh, proving point. The proving point for Jordan Kingsley to prove to the Coastal Empire Wrestling fan base that he can do it on his own. Absolutely. Absolutely. And if you're a, if you're a fan of independent wrestling, if you're a fan of Georgia wrestling, you know about Jordan Kingsley. Yes. You know what he has done in this team. You've seen the great matches that he's had at top promotions all over the Southeast. But since Jordan Noir, his attitude has changed, his demeanor has changed, the way he works in the ring has changed. He's just become an overall scumbag. He has. Overall scumbag. But tonight he is on his own, and we may, he may have to dig into that old back of tricks tonight if he wants to win this match. He may have to, and maybe he's got some tricks up that mask of his. Yeah, I don't, I don't know what to do with that mask. Yet. The athleticism of Rob Kilquack. The athleticism of Rob Kildred just backflipping yes. off the ropes. That was crazy. Two guys staring each other down here. I think Kingsley's staring you down. I can't really yes. tell. Yes, really it's kind of hard to tell. Yeah, it's hard to tell. Nice reversal there by Kingsley, though. He can see well enough. Oh, sunset flip. Oh, well through by Kingsley. Oh, what's he got right here? Oh, off oh. the legs. Rob acting like a little duck, yes. wobbling, wobbling, wobbling. Oh, and Rob Kilgore faked him out with the punch. Kingsley ducked and got kicked in the face for his trouble. And, and just the veteran know-how of Rob Kilgore there. Very quick thinking. He's the prince of the night. I'm not I, sure. He might be. I don't know. It's so hard to 
tell what he's even thinking with the, the change that he's gone through in the last few months. Easily thinks. I, probably I'm not anymore. Probably not anymore since he started hanging out with the other members of New R. Fair enough. Fair enough. He's probably been, been a, a pretty big degenerate. I, I've, I've heard that Mrs. Wright is a brave better organization. I wouldn't be surprised. It's definitely not Mr. Wright. That's right. Yeah. I won't tell him you said that. I'll tell him myself. We all know that Mrs. Wright wears the pants in yes, We do. It's not something he'll openly admit. No. But, you know. No, he won't admit it in public. Well, but, that's neither here nor there. But, she's, but you know, the Bible says that women should be subservient to their men. He really needs to get her in line. It's also 2024. Gender rules aren't a thing anymore, Pastor. I think you need to read the Old Testament again. Uh, I, I think you need to read the Old Testament name again. It's the Old Testament for a reason, sir. Because it was the First Testament. Uh, it, because it's old and is outdated. It needs to be updated. I don't know who got the worst of that I don't one. know either. That looks like they kicked each other straight out of their boots. They're all down. Who's he got? It looks like Kingsley might be able to get up to his feet first. Simply because he, he was held up by the brothers. Kingsley back to the vertical base. Staying right. Oh. Kingsley doesn't know where he is right now. Especially after that job record. Yes. Rob Kiljoy has an extremely hard hit. That he does. Oh. Daddy leg rock. Kingsley on the right. second row. Oh, he went for that avalanche head punch again. But Rob Kiljoy was ready for it and caught him in that beautiful. Kiljoy needs to stay on him. He needs to make the pin. He's, he's trying he's to fill up the momentum up. here. And the crowd quack, 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 quack. The crowd's quacking. Quack. Kiljoy all quack. over him. Quack! Big chop to the back, Quack! and another to the front. Quack! Again to the just Quack! back and forth. So you know how there's lamb chops? We can start calling those the duck chops. Okay, sure. The duck chops. Oh! Duck chop to the back. Oh! Chuck a duck, it's over. That may be it. One, two, three. Oh! I cannot believe Kingsley kicked out of that. I'm impressed. I don't think Killjoy can believe it either. I he thought he, he had can. it. I, I'm not going to lie. I'm impressed by Kingsley right now. That, he I is, thought it was done. He is showing a lot of heart tonight against one of the top competitors in wrestling. One of the toughest competitors in wrestling. Yeah, this man, weird. I've seen this man do some absolutely crazy, crazy things. Looks like he was setting him up for Denver to be a team. But Kingsley, able to fight his way out, looks snap there. It's been a Rooney, you know. Pop up, power bomb! One, two, three! Two! That was just a two. I don't know how close they could have done it. In the split second, it would have been three. That's about as close to a three as you can get. The, the only thing I can think of is these men aren't human. Yes. They are not mortals. Anyone who can step into that ring and compete like this, they're, well, they're not human. It just shows how important a victory in this match is. Two guys who are trying to elevate themselves from position here within the roster. There's no title on the line, but they could earn a future title. Oh! Absolutely. What a move! That could be it! Kingsley kicked Still out of that! Of away. Well, Jordan Kingsley here. He is showing me something tonight. The Slingshot 1916, no one's ever kicked out before. He hit him with the deal. It's unbelievable. Kingsley kicked out of the deal, that's why. What is Killjoy gonna have to do to put him away? Well, what have I been saying all match, Pastor? Ducks fly together. Quack! Oh, he went for that duck stop. Oh, Killjoy able to get out of the way, though. Great wing awareness from Killjoy. Huh? I see. Oh! And I think I just saw one of Rob's tooth yeah. leave his mouth, followed by the uh, by the spinning that was night him. kick. Oh! He just hit him with three massive moves. That's, that's, that's got to be it. One, be two, it. three. How did he kick out? Rob 
Killjoy, no quit in him tonight. I don't know if I've ever seen such resilience in any competitor before. It, it, it just it goes to show how important this stage is for these gentlemen. Yes, in, in any match, any match, win or loss could change your career forever. Position on that backslide. Yeah, they both got all. Oh, Kingsley able to reverse. He's got the underhooks. Is he gonna be able to get him down? Does he have the strength? Oh, Killjoy's reversing. No. Oh, oh, Killjoy's got the unders. He's trying to get him over. Oh, Killjoy has to do is get that left knee underneath him. He can get that leverage. Oh, Kingsley able to reverse. This is an absolute beautiful, unorthodox test of strength. Two evenly matched competitors here. And, and Killjoy cracking, cracking while he's in the backslide, trying to get the crowd behind him. I think Killjoy might be able to get him here. Oh, he's able to roll around. What a... Oh, he got, got him. him, he got him. He got him. He got him. I don't know if I, don't know if I would call that an upset, but... I would call that an upset, but I would call that a shock. Yes, yes. yes. Definitely not an upset, but I was not expecting that. I've never seen a backslide like that before. Wow! Out of nowhere, it looked like these guys were 50-50 were running right there at the end, and it could go either way. But just the knowledge of Rob Kiljo and his ring awareness and that veteran know-how, he was able to pull out the victory in this one. And what a huge victory it is as he tries to elevate himself into a title pitcher here at Coastal Empire Wrestling. With this victory, he's definitely going to climb the ranks. And, and, and the question is, does this just go to show that Kingsley cannot win without the wall?